Hey, what's up, guys? It's Arlie, and I am reacting to Muslim Azan versus the Jewish Azan. So, without further ado, let's get right into it and check it out. See what we learned today. Whoa, whoa, so first thing I picked up is that his voice is very, very strong. Hassam is God, so who is Hassam? I'm not sure. You guys can tell me in the comments down below. Oh, it says Hassam is the God. So Hassam is the same as God uh, in Christianity? I'm not sure. <laughs> Dang, he is, he is going hard. Alright, this is where we're here for. We got the uh, Muslim call to prayer. Let's check it out. Let's see. Um, down below in the comments, please educate me. I'm letting you know, guys. I'm not that religious. I'm agnostic, but I'm here to learn. So, in the comments, of course, tell me down below what I'm getting wrong, what I'm missing, and things like that. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. I kind of got to close your eyes and you just got to listen. It's very, their voices are very powerful. Allah 
So that video, man, that made me relax. So hearing the Muslim prayer definitely made me relaxed. Hearing the Jewish prayer made me kind of more alert, if that makes sense. But they both have very strong voices. I don't know too much of the differences, but man, they are powerful. They're like, but the Muslim Azan was almost like pulling me. And I was just, I had to relax and close my eyes and listen. Same thing with the uh, Jewish Azan. The, their voices are powerful. Um, religion is very powerful. And my, like I was just, everything in my life didn't matter. I just listened to the prayer. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, the comparison in between. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, peace. Let me know if you guys want me to react to the Quran or anything else. Uh, but yeah, bye.